Felix Afna Jan was unveiled by his new club Cremonese yesterday after completing his transfer from Italian giant AS Roma. It was just a matter of time for this move to happen after it became crystal clear that he is not in the plans of Jose Mourinho for their 2022-2023 campaign. His new club is pretty much unknown to many Ghanaians. Apparently, it's not one of the elite clubs in Europe. But I want to share with you some facts about this club you probably didn't know about. And perhaps it will help you know the club a bit more. So without any further introduction, let's begin. Now, the grounds of Cremonese or the stadium of the club is called Stadio Giovanni Zini. Actually, it has a capacity which is little over 20,000. It was built 103 years ago, that is in 1999, and Cremonese has been the tenant since it was built. And the name of the stadium, Giovanni Zini, is actually a name of a former player. Giovanni Zini was a former goalkeeper of Cremonese. During the First World War, which started in 1914 and ended in 1918, the Italian goalkeeper died. And in a bid to honor him, the stadium was rechristened as Giovanni Zini five years after it was built. Now, another fact about Felix Afnajan's new club, Cremonese, is that it is funny, but it's a fact. Felix Afnajan happens to be their 20th signing this summer. Actually, he's still counting, but at the moment, they have signed 20 players so far. Actually, I don't know any club in Europe who has done this at the moment. I know Nottingham Forest are also having a busy summer. But I know they've signed 18 players so far. Felix Ohinejan completed his move yesterday to Cremonese to become their 20th signing this summer. And it's quite understandable because it's been 26 years of absence in the Italian top flight. And they are keen on making a telling impact and avoiding getting relegated again. And in this regard, they've made all the signings, of which some of them are high profile players. Aside Felix Afnajan, they signed Nigerian forward Ciro Dizes from Belgian giant Genk for 6.5 million euros. Another Nigerian contingent, David Okereke, was also signed from reigning Belgian champion Club Brugge. Argentine midfielder Santiago Ascasiba has also joined Cremonisi on loan from Hertha Berlin as the club hoped to achieve a high finish in their first season after 26 years. Now some of the big players who played for Cremonisi, former Chelsea, Juventus and Italian international, Gianluca Vialli is one of them. He's actually a product of the youth system of the club. However, he is best remembered for his time at Sampdoria, where he spent most of his career before joining Juventus. He also had stints in England with Chelsea, where he later became a player manager following the sack of Ruth Gullit. And as a manager of Chelsea, he won the FA Cup, the League Cup, the FA Charity Shield, the UEFA Winners' Cup and the UEFA Super Cup. Vialli is currently one of the non-playing staff of the Italian national team. Enrico Chiesa, the father of Juventus star Federico Chiesa, and former Paris Saint-Germain goalkeeper Salvatore Sirigu includes notable players who played for this club. Now the all-time top scorer of this team scored 76 goals. He goes by the name Andrea Briganti. The Italian forward played for Cremonese from 2013 to 2018 and according to statistics available, he played about 196 times for Cremonese and registered 76 goals and in the entire history of the club, he is and remains the all-time top scorer of Cremonisi. Can Felix Afnajan score the same number of goals in five years or break this record by scoring more? Well, let's wait and see how life at his new club goes. Okay. Now, in the history of the club, records available shows that Felix Afnajan is the third Ghanaian player to join the club. The first was former Olympic Lyon Ren, Sunderland and Black Stars defender John Mensah. The second is Ghanaian midfielder Joshua Tinkran, who was signed by the club six days ago. Cremonisi was the fifth club he joined in Europe after leaving Ghana. It was actually a loan spell from his parent club, Kievo. Jomensa joined Kievo in 2002. In 2004, he was loaned to Modena, but the loan spell was unsuccessful. In the 2005-2006 season, he was loaned to Cremonisi, and after impressing at the club, he caught the attention of French giant Ren, where he initially joined on loan before being sold permanently to the club by Kievo. Felix Afnajan joined Cremonisi has rewritten history, becoming the third player after John Mensah and Joshua Tinkran to play for Cremonese. Look at me, I'm such a... Now the last one I'll be talking about is their best ever ranking in the Serie A. The team recorded its best ever ranking in the Italian top flight in the 1993-1994 season, where they finished 10th, which remains their best ever ranking in their history. But unfortunately for them, two years after that season, they were relegated to the Serie B. And after 26 years of languishing in the lower tier football leagues, they returned to the Serie A this year, 2022. Cremonese have played three games in the Serie A this season and have lost all three and are yet to win a game. 
Following the arrival of Felix Afnajan, they will be hoping to get him back to winning ways as soon as possible as they look forward to achieving a high finish and avoiding relegation. On this note, thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Don't hesitate to comment as well. And until we meet in our next video, it's bye for now.